Okay, so today is another day for me to review another keyboard that I ordered to replace my current one that I have here in front of me. And I used the Royal Clutch one because I wanted to reset up everything to match my current white setup. And let me show you my current keyboard. I showed you this before. It's the Royal Clutch. So it's all white. And uh, I like this keyboard, but I need a full size one for the rest of my stuff in the box just arrived today. So I'm gonna open this up with you and uh, just show you what keyboard I ordered. Still gonna be a Royal Clutch one because I really love the Royal Clutch series as well as the iJust series. So this is a Royal Clutch keyboard and it came with a box and another box. <laughs> so let's go here. I'm gonna throw this one away. I'm not sure there's something inside. Oh! They gave me a freebie. So before I review the keyboard, they give me this League of Legends freebie. Yeah, it's good. I'm gonna give this away. So I don't know guys, if you want this, I could give this away. And then let me know by the comment section. But first, just uh, Help me grow this channel by liking and subscribing and telling your friends about it. So here we go. It's the Royal Clutch keyboard. This is in the front and this one on the side. This one for the back, the back, back of the box in the side. Uh, I think it's in the left or right side. I'm not sure. Anyway, so it's in the right side here and that's the model number RK918 RGB so you'll expect that this is an RGB keyboard and in the back there's nothing but the keyboard layout so this is a mechanical keyboard and let's go unboxing I'm excited guys because I really like the preview of this uh, RK keyboard RGB keyboard and again it's in white so there you go guys, wow. This is pretty nice. So I really like to say nice because that's my trademark thing to say. But it's, it is surrounded by a back, uh, I mean foam backing. And uh, okay, we have the keyboard here and I'm, I'm just gonna adjust the camera now to show you the contents. Okay, hold on a bit because I'm using a ball head to make it uh, flow better. So inside the box we have the keyboard, the cable. So one of the things that I immediately noticed that it's not the same as other keyboards that I have in other mechanical keyboard is the wire. The, the wire is non-removable, so that's a bummer. And what's inside the box? What else? What else do we have here? Put this aside at first. We have this QR card. I think it's a warranty card. And a keycap puller. So if you're wondering why, why we have this, it's for pulling out, pulling out the keycaps. You know, when you pull this out and you want to replace the keycap, you can use this one. So I have lots of this because I love to collect keyboards. And this December, I'm gonna give away a lot of my keyboards and you know i just don't know how to do that yet on youtube but i can you can tell me or teach me how to do those things properly so here we go so what we have here is a full size keyboard first i'm going to remove this box right here so to keep things clean okay Okay, so we have a full-size keyboard right here and uh, we have the Royal Clutch logo here. The finish is actually silver but on the preview I saw it as white but it's okay because it's very light and it is made of aluminum. Okay, so let me show you the details and let me move the light a bit in the front and uh, 
you know, change the color to white. So you'll see the exact details, okay. There you go. So it's lifted. The finish of the keycap itself is milk white. It has some sort of a nice texture. And on the sides, this is the side profile. I mean the front profile of the sides. Okay. Same way here. The sides. So you're wondering why it's translucent because this is the part that is RGB. Whoa. And it's a full-size keyboard. Again, it's the, the, the keys are non-removable. I mean the USB plug here is non-removable. It has some... This is the bottom. Okay. And uh, it has... It has this uh, riser here. Sorry about the ant. It has a rubber tip. So I'm just going to show you closer. And just... Uh, focus and there you go so this is the the footer the, the foot here it's rubber and it locks in place when you put it like that and same way on the other side okay same way on the other side and on the bottom there's no rubber here there are just bumps like so but it's made of rubber so this bump right here there are one two three Four, four, five rubber stoppers for the keyboard and that's how it looks it's on the table okay so I don't know the operation for this yet so there you go so as you can see there guys sliding up and I think there are changes for the controls here the same as the other keyboards and I'm gonna show you that later after I continue with the video okay so right now I found the, the best uh, position so I can show you the, the effects of the keyboard so we have a few buttons here there you can see it there so this is probably for the controls because we don't have an instruction manual or booklet inside the keyboard box so I will. I think I'm gonna have another review for this one to to make to show you how to make use of this. So I think this one is for the intensity of the light. So first, I think we're gonna press F N. So this is for the speed right here. We can slow it down. So as you can see, it's slowing down. It's going fast. Okay, these are the effects for the top of the keyboard. So as you can see that the, the keys are changing there okay so the speed of the change are gonna be based on the other keys that we have for example this one the rainbow scroll and you can speed it up as you can see there you can slow it down then you can brighten it up or turn it its intensity up, turn it down, or turn it off. And then we have a few here. Uh, there's I don't know what this is for. I think it's for for signing keys. Yeah, it's for signing keys because it's moving the colors. And this one I'm not sure what this, ah this is for the bottom. Can you see that guys? So this turns it off. This is the rainbow color, reverse color from the center, cycling on the colors, fading in and out, so I don't, I don't, anyway, so you can switch it back on with the rest of the colors, and you can select the colors that you want, for example, you want to fade in and out with white, Intensify it. It's gonna show you a lot of the settings here, and I'm gonna learn more about it. But for now, I'm just gonna assign what I like. So I'm gonna slow down the rainbow. I'm gonna use the rainbow colors here. Intensify it a lot, and speed it up to come with the bottom here. So that's it, guys. I hope you like this review of the new arcade keyboard that I have again 
This particular model is RK918 and this is how it sounds before I forget. I'm gonna move the microphone near the keyboard so you can hear the, the, the profile of this keyboard. So let me hear some thump. It's a mechanical keyboard and it sounds great. Okay, so let me know by the comment section what you think about this keyboard and thanks for continually watching my channel. I appreciate a like and a subscription and the bell icon. Thank you for watching.